Welcome back to the channel, everybody. What do we got going today on the Blackstone? Yuck. Yokisabi noodles. You know, the same stuff you see in those fancy Japanese restaurants? That's what we got. First things first. Boosh! Oh, that's good beer. All right, what you're gonna need? Garlic. You're gonna need some uh, sesame garlic sauce. And then you're gonna need some soy sauce. That's Generation X soy sauce, not the soy sauce from the millennials. Just put it out there. All right, get some oil, some water, about four eggs gonna need green onions, onions, green onions, onions, butter, uh, what else do we got in there? Cabbage, don't forget the cabbage, and uh, just whatever else you guys want to throw in there, just throw in there. Oh, and zucchini, you need zucchini. And then of course, chicken. We're doing the noodles inside right now. They'll be ready in a couple minutes and we'll bring them out. But for right now, let's get cooking the chicken. All right, while well, you guys see that we got the chicken going, um, we're only gonna use two chicken breasts tonight and that will make us a meal for tonight and one for leftovers. This is uh, quite a bit. So right there, we got our uh, noodles, which are pretty much ready to go. I want to show you how fine all of this is cut. This is just diced perfectly by my wife. Unbelievable. All right, we just need to give her a little final chop here. Pretty good there. Slide this over to the side. I think that's how they do it there. Grab one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's good beer. Now with my lovely wife of 17 years just the other day that video has come out finally chopped some green onions some onions zucchini, zucchini green, pepper. green peppers and cabbage don't put the cabbage on yet don't put the cabbage on yet everything else put her on a little butter a little butter in that bad boy And some good old garlic. Minced garlic. Minced garlic. Do not forget the garlic. How much? That much. <laughs> Actually, a little bit more. <laughs> That's about good right there. Get that butter right in the middle with the garlic. Let that just kind of cook down, melt down. And we'll be ready for step, uh, whatever step is. Oh, we'll be ready for it. All right, guys, we are back for the next step. Take all of your veggies. Get them bad boys ready to go. Don't forget the eggs. Make a little circle like that. If you're a plaster, you know what I'm talking about.
get those bad boys in there, let them uh, cook up just a touch. And you got to make sure that you put the actual eggs in there and let them cook because if you pour them on everything, it ain't going to cook. give those a minute to go all right time for some noodles hit them with a little water that's time to get some of uh, your uh, garlic sauce on there garlic sesame, huh? garlic sesame sauce my lovely wife right over there of 17 years mm -mm -mm. tell you what <laughs> try to mix that a little bit in Get like that good caramelization going on that bad boy. We're just gonna throw a little Generation X soy sauce in the thing. Not a whole lot. Just enough. I'll tell you what, if you could have smell-o-vision right now, you guys would be on the floor. Now we're ready for the chicken that was already cooked and the finely chopped cabbage. Give that a good uh, stir and then let everything kind of soak in, let all the flavors get everywhere. All right, if it seems like it's getting a little dry, you go ahead and just hit it with a little water, loosen it up a little bit. Okay, we have just 17 <laughs> years. 17 years! Unbelievable. Hi! <laughs> she is so hot. All right, uh, don't forget some uh, hot chili oil if you want to just spice it up a little bit. The food, that doesn't need to be spiced up at all. <laughs> brownie all right. points. Brownie, totally brownie points. All right, so everything was here, just halved it up because we're going to eat this again for uh, leftovers. And then uh, on half, so then you get a quarter. And here we go. Show them, show them. Can you believe that? Up a little bit, up a little bit. It's a little hot. It's a little hot. <laughs> this is how you do a little black stone when your RV. Oh, that's a lot of hot. It's a lot of hot, guys. I'll tell you what, this stuff is so good. Go ahead and put on a little hot chili powder or chili oil when, uh, when you want a little heat to it. Other than that, there you go. You got any questions what I used other than the black stone? Any other thing, go ahead and uh, put a comment down below. Anything else? We're going to get to eating. Appreciate you guys uh, joining in. <laughs> She's so cute. Anyway, uh, <laughs> uh, I think that's it. All right, guys. Hey, till next time, throw the bones. Thanks for joining me. I'll have another uh, 
meal coming up real soon.